My story with the FAC and the Morris Children's Hospital really started about eight years ago. I was desperately looking for a hematology oncologist that could provide support to my daughter. And so when I found Nemours, I went on the website and just really tried to find every opportunity that I could to get involved, to be able to learn more about my daughter's illness, really in hopes as a parent to be able to provide more support to her. Clinician and families partnering in the care of their children is an integral part of healthcare. I mean, as a mom, I know what I like and need for my children. Um, and as a clinician, knowing that, you know, they have the science-based, the evidence-based um, practices to treat their children, I think that parents and clinicians partnering would just take it beyond. And Amores was really interested in hearing my experience with my son getting an IV placed while we were in the ICU. It was not a great experience, <laughs> but after I shared my experience, that feedback helped them figure out how exactly to implement the DEPA project. We explained how having a child with difficult IV access could be mediated by using an ultrasound machine. And the ultrasound machine gives us a picture of the vein so that we can see it going into the vessel and not have to um, stick multiple times. Having us as parents being able to provide our perspective to the nurses that were involved in the DIVA project was really important. I myself and my daughters are patients that experience that difficult access when it comes to IVs. Just knowing that concerns were heard and taken into consideration as the hospital and their nursing team built out this project was really something that was very important and impactful, I would say, for a lot of us as parents. One of the things that the FAC does is it brings us as parents together. I feel like the parents of children with chronic illnesses, we are part of a unique club. And I would encourage parents to get involved with the FAC as a way of being able to get emotional support from other parents that know what it feels like to be in their shoes and to have to struggle with the things that we struggle with. And most importantly, be able to provide feedback to the hospital and the different teams about what it takes to care for a child day to day, not only physically, but also emotionally, that's living with a chronic illness.